you know, it's a real pity. Um, as I said to you on Monday in Dangriga, everything that Melvin said could have been forgiven. We all bad talk one another, and it's a real shame that what he said privately was recorded. But in terms of the tape recording, everything, as far as I'm concerned, was fair game, if not fair comment, uh, except for the allegation in terms of Mahmoud and um, Ivan. Ivan Ramos. And Lord, man, Melvin said it with such authority. And as he considered afterwards, he knew that that was uh, absolute nonsense. Um, uh, but, but, but I know Melvin Hulse, and I've known him for years, and there's not a mean bone in his body. You know? There's no malice where Melvin is concerned. He loves to mouth off, and when he's disgruntled, he will mouth off even more. And so I certainly hold absolutely nothing against him for what he said. He took the decision, his executive, the people in San Creek West were upset. He took the decision that that tape would come back to haunt him uh, during any campaign that he would pursue for Stan Creek West, and so he decided that the best thing was for him to resign. I can tell you that he and I have spoken that we will meet, and going forward, uh, we will find a role for Melvin to play in the constituency in support of whoever is chosen to be the new 